All right, so to wrap up this whole topic of convection, let's look at what are the most important things you always need to remember about convection. So first of all, convection occurs as molecules in, what kind of thing can convection happen in? Only in a fluid, as they gain energy and they lose energy. That's where we can see convection. So now, looking at the different kinds of fluids, we have warm fluids. Warm fluids rise because they are less dense. Oops. Less dense. The molecules are more spread out, so then they rise up to the top. However, the opposite, cold fluids, instead of rising, they sink because they are more dense. Those are the most important things. Warm fluids rise, cold fluids sink. And as this happens over and over and over again, as things warm up and then they cool down, we create convection currents. Are created as a pattern of rising and falling develops. Excellent. Those are the most important things of convection currents. And you can see it if you look at the lava lamp. You can watch things rise and fall. As well as this final site, this final link down here, will show you some more good examples of how things can rise and fall in a convection current.